Lignanti, the favourite, just back fractionally off the line. Into the back straight they go. 1,609 metres, and they're off and pacing, and Noble Victory on the inside began nicely. Uh, Cruz and Elmo from out wide is showing speed, and there's Clifford Franklin punching through the centre in search of the lead. And as they hit that first turn, it's Clifford Franklin on the outside of Noble Victory, and they go together. Noble Victory still holding the inside. In the third spot, Aqua Cruiser, and Clifford Elmo trapped a little bit wide early. Uh, on the inside, Lucky Ned Pepper ends up the spot behind the leader, followed by Lynn Yanty. Dean Ace is on its inside from Rich Rock and Rustler, and Solomon Bandy is at the tail of the field. 29-1 was the first quarter. They make their way into the straight, and it's Noble Victory was able to hold the lead from gate one, and Noble Victory shows out over Clifford Franklin facing the breeze, and Lucky Ned Pepper leaders back. Aqua Cruiser 1-1, one, one, and now Cruz and Elmo makes a bit of a sprint up on the outside, three wide. The favourite, Lynn Yanti, is back third last in the centre. It's covering up Dean Aces on its outside was Rich Rock and Rustler, and Solomon Bandy is at the tail of the field. They leave the home straight, and they've got 850 metres left to run. They're about to get the second quarter now, and the second quarter came up in 32, so they slowed it right down. Noble victory on top over Clifford Franklin. Three wide was Cruz and Elmo up on the outside, and Aqua Cruiser 1-1. One, one. It's locked away at the moment, followed by Lucky Ned Pepper, the inside. Wider on the track, Rich Rock and Rustler. Lynn Yanti's about to get onto its back from Dean Aces and Solomon Bandy's at the tail of the field. Down the back straight they run. 500 metres left to travel and it's still noble, noble victory on top of Clifford Franklin. Cruz and Elmo out wide is under pressure. Lacqua Cruz is in the centre still with nowhere to go. Lucky Ned Pepper the inside. Rich Rock and Rustler is now making ground deeper on the track and here comes the favourite Lin Yanti. He's five wide coming up to the home bend. They ran off the back in 29.7. Quickly Lin Yanti cruised up on the outside and ran to the lead over the inside. Noble victory and then Clifford Franklin further back Cruz and Elmo dropping off, Aqua Cruz is about to get clear, Lin Yanti went to the lead over Clifford Franklin, it's Lin Yanti narrowly in front, Clifford Franklin sticking on, but Lin Yanti the favourite's going to be too strong, and Lin Yanti beat Clifford Franklin, photo third maybe uh, Lucky Ned Pepper just in front of Aqua Cruiser and Noble Victory back on the inside, then Dean Aces, Rich Rock and Rustler, Solomon Vandy, Cruz and Elmo after a torrid run three wide finished at the rear, 28-9 was the run down the back, and they've run 159-8 that was fairly uh, effortless for Lin Yanti, number four. 29-1 was the first quarter. 159-8 the overall time. Clifford Franklin is uh, the rank out, or close to rank outsider. It was a $63 chance on the win tote. It'll pay $6.80 for the place. Lin Yanti, $1.40 and $1.04. And we'll stand by for the third number. Judge calling for the photo. Lucky Ned Pepper was the prominent one there. So the winner, number four, Lin Yanti, is very heavily backed here. Last start, went second. A brown gelding four years by Safari out of Nixa Beach, owned by C. Miles, trained by Clayton Harmy and driven by Michael Formosa. Number seven, second, Clifford Franklin. A black gelding eight years by just another poor boy out of Guiding Angel is owned by W Brown, trained and driven by Greg Brown. And number five does get third, that being Lucky Ned Pepper, who's a Bay Gilding six years, by a PB Bullville out of Classic Light, owned by L Taylor, trained and driven by Jamie Casser. 4753, 4753, 159.7, 29.132 even, 29.7.